What's up, YouTube? I got several requests that I can now actually do. My Hoover commercial versus my Sanitaire SC886. The reason I couldn't do the Hoover before was didn't have a power switch, so I nigger rigged it for now. Just to get it to run without direct wiring it, I put a Sanitaire power button. Works good and I'll be doing a cat litter test. Don't worry YouTubers who who always tell me it makes the machine really dirty. I take my machines apart and I clean them all the time. So, all right, first test, I'm gonna do the Hoover. Also, I just lost a wheel on it. <laughs> so, it's gonna be a little lopsided. So, here we go. As you can see, the Hoover is actually missing a lot. I thought it'd be doing better than this, honestly. I can honestly say, I thought this thing would do a lot better than it did. This was a versus test between my Hoover and the Sanitaire, but I'm already pretty sure the Sanitaire is going to kick its ass, so let's start with the Sanitaire. Or better yet, let me do a little bit more with this. Sorry, I can't make up my mind today. <laughs> Not very good. Honestly, it surprised me. I actually thought it would be equal to the Sanitaire. But now let's give the Sanitaire a go at it.
Now, this was actually a surprise to me. I thought the Hoover would be equal to the Sanitaire. I thought it would clean just as good. But, as you can see, it took a lot longer for the Hoover to clean it up. Also, it made a mess. I don't know if you all can see all the dust and everything from the cat litter. And if you look at the Sanitaire, none. And all the seals in the Hoover are good. It's not missing a motor seal or anything, and there's no quick clean chamber on this one, so it's really nowhere it could have escaped from. I don't know. But that's the video. And comment, please comment. I need more comments. <laughs> um rate. Um I don't know. Guess that's about it. So until next time. See you.